I heard about it. I didn't leave my room for a few weeks. You have a... You have, you have a very paranoid personality, you know that? So you heard there was some... There would be a massive change and hid in your room. Trying to just ride out the change? Nah, I decided to do something about it. I found the student council office after a while, and man, I marched right in with a list of demands, and a bunch of people I grabbed in order to make myself look like I had superior, uh, supporters. Wait, so not only did it not happen, but no one even cared. Kenji doesn't hear me, having gotten a good momentum going. Wrapped up in the energy of his own ranting, he starts to completely flip out and flail his arms appear appearing to be wild, throwing gang signs. <laughs> East side, west side, east side, west side, east side, west side, oh! <laughs> I walked up to the desk and she and said to her, Hey, you fascist woman! What is this badge idea? How out of touch can you be? Here is your ivory tower, sm uh, smugly looking down upon us like we're just a bunch of idiots who do you think you are meanwhile she's deaf your level of elitism is terrible you're probably one of those outrageous rich people who have chauffeurs drive them around slums so they can point and laugh and only drink pricey coffee beans shat out by the last living dinosaur and brood the South Coast God. <laughs> that sounds awesome. I don't even drink coffee. That sounds freaking awesome. That sounds delightful. That sounds actually kind of stale, but awesome. Uh... And you know, uh, and how could you go up, uh, open up a history book? Don't you know what the Borgesis, is, is, Borgos, what the fuck? Stop breaking out in large words that I can't read. That Borgosi, Borgosi, whatever, are always overthrown in a bloody revolution for shit like this stupid you're an idiot she's deaf sure the revolutionaries usually end up turning around everything into utter clusterfuck god you are you use you a lot of swears don't you later on but a maniac is the only kind of person who would create a policy like this it's like something I would create to make some people suffer. Only real. And you want to introduce, 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 institutionalize it. Uh, yeah. I, I just repeated myself multiple times on institutionalize. Shoot me. <laughs> Where w oh, Sorry. Where will this discrimination of our rights end? We are people. This is not justice. That's what I said. Then I decided to cry uh, of they added a cry of they can take our things, but they'll never take our freedom. To appeal to the masses, like it in that movie about the life of William Wallace, where they took his things, but not his freedom, and killed him. So you watch American movies? 
Take it, take our lives! About to have never take our freedom! Then dead. <laughs> but she just ignored me and didn't even look up from writing in her little paper shit. <laughs> he doesn't realize that she's deaf. Maybe I overwhelmed her with my logic so badly that she just retreated into denial. Maybe she's an asshole. <laughs> uh, either way, she didn't reply, and the future refused to change. Okay. <laughs> to top it off, on the way back, I realized I lost my student ID somewhere. <laughs> uh, I think, I think at some point, I think he, 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 he yeah, I'll just keep reading. I'll leave my hypothesis at the end of this. Mm. This is the story of my life. A constant and seemingly futile struggle. Like trying to climb up a brick wall with sponges for hands. That's a weird, weird, weird thing to say. Anyway, I think he originally was just trying to find a student ID, but somehow thought there was some weird plan on badges. <laughs> From school IDs to badges. Meh. Hey, you said nothing changed, but she didn't make anyone wear a student badge. No, wear a bunch of student badges. So it did change. Yeah, fuck your logic, Kenji. It's flawed. Yeah, that's true. Okay, maybe. They're not so bad then. I guess that counts for something. If I can get Kenji to admit that maybe two women may not be so bad after all, I'll take it. <laughs> Especially if it allows me to slip out of this conversation. I didn't realize how much time had gone by. I tried to run through my usual morning routines as quickly as possible. I check my watch again I as I leave the dorms and see that I'm already late. Thanks, Kenji. Uh, fortunately, the rest of the day goes more smoothly. The r after and after classes are over, I head to meet Suzune again. Uh, sorry, I just had to take a drink of water there. Uh, behind the school, I catch her leaning against a completed stand with parts of it still flecked, uh, flecked with bits of paper and tape remnants of signs from the last time it was used. So it was used twice. How, it's gonna be read How many times has it been used? How many times has it been used? Like, seriously, like, at some point it will break. <laughs> uh, I think. Yeah, at some point it will break. Uh, whatever. <clears throat> That's admittedly spinning a nail in her hand. She doesn't notice me yet. <coughs> Got my throat. The temptation to speak up on her uh, sneak speak up wow. The temptation to sneak up on her is unbearable. Years of watching foreign wildlife documentaries have prepared me for this moment. For this I want, want my, I'm downwind. Con <laughs> conditions are for, uh, favorable. However, the more I think about it, the more it seems like a bad idea. Do it. <laughs> Do it if it's cool. If get caught halfway, I look like an idiot. And if I, if she doesn't know it's me, I could end up. With an injury. Either way, I'll also look 
a little insensitive. So, I th- it would pro- probably be best not to try anything funny. As disappointing as it is. <sighs> Hiso. 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 You could have still done it. <laughs> I walk in front of her, straighten her, <laughs> startling her a little bit, a little. BAM! It still worked! Just not as much. Why so surprised? Did I catch you slacking off? Ooh. No, I was just taking a break. You don't look like you've even broke a sweat. That's some break there, President. Ooh, teasing. Teasing. Susan made the eyes dart back and forth momentarily, and I think I managed to fluster her. No shit. <laughs> I think um, in sign language, it, it probably it's hard to tell when someone's being sarcastic or being like oh my, uh, OMG serious lols. Um, there's an expiration on expression on her face and a little tension as well but she can't back down that would be unthinkable for her her fingers dance across each other impatiently <sighs> you're acting comp- uh, competitive <laughs> competitive today are you uh, sorry I'm, I'm actually reading her out of uh, her voice you're acting uh, competitive today. Are you trying to uh, get my blood boiling? Do you uh, want to make it a contest? We'll race to see who can construct the most stalls by sundown. Oh. No, no, I'm teasing you. <laughs> it's okay. It's not a real student council if you can't uh, tease a student council president, little. You agree, don't you? That isn't student council uh, charter, so it's not true. <laughs> there is no charter. <laughs> At least I don't think there is. The only thing they pledge loyalty to is a stack of takeout menus. Anyway. <clears throat> oh, wow, I just went back into my mail voice. Anyway, it's not good that you... Uh, you're finally th- here. Anyway, it's good that you're finally here. Even if you could have been earlier. <laughs> Tried to cough halfway through that. Pick up a hammer, and we'll resume where we left off. As we work assembling stalls again, I slowly realize that they're really much less work than I really than I would have expected. In fact, according to Zune, we should be done by the end of the day. With a little luck. Cool. Last time I did uh, something like this for them, it took her, Misha, and myself almost four days to do it. And it can't be just my imagination. You know, this seems like too much uh, th- uh, it doesn't seem like that much work. It's because it, it's because it isn't. The answer leaves me wanting a little more, knowing that it isn't the best. Susan A puts her hammer, uh, puts down her ha- hammer to elaborate. It would be impossible for two, uh, for two people to put that much work in uh, less than a week. The uh, truth is, I don't dismantle half the stalls. I just store them someplace where actually more like I hide them in plain sight. Damn. Damn, you smart. She waggles her a finger mischiefly. But that's a secret, and it's not proper to reveal the secret of the trade. You're not a magician. <laughs> Winking, she takes out two plastic containers of her out from her bag, 
then puts them down on the board before raising her hand slightly as of to say, Ta-da! I made lunches today for both of us. Oh, you're so cool. You're so cool. I could go for a, a pack of lunch right now. I'm kind of hungry. You know it's closer to dinner time. Uh, you can have this one. The food shifts in my bag, and now some of it's mixed up together. She hands me the one of uh, one of the containers. I open it. It looks delicious. If a simp, if a, a little simple. She hands me a pair of chopsticks, as if she's just remembered to. And I eat what looks like some grilled beef. Mm. That's very tasty. I don't, I don't like your food touch other food. <laughs> you don't like, oh my, oh man, oh man. Okay. You don't like your food touching other food? Uh, of course she doesn't. <laughs> A freaking five year old. I do not. You're very picky. Sometimes I mix my food on my own, but not always, and not everything. I don't like it when it's done for me. What is it? What's important? <laughs> what is important is the choice. Uh, yeah, I see the point there. She points the, uh, the set. Essentially, to emphasize it. And, 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 emphasize it. And then breaks her chopsticks apart to eat her own meal. As I continue to eat, I notice two things. The first is that almost everything I'm eating besides the rice is fried. <laughs> yeah, even the vegetables are fried. Did, did you fry everything? There's so much meat, and there's so much meat. Yeah, it's too much meat. You can't handle this meat. Does she eat this kind of stuff all the time? I wonder how she managed to stay so thin in spite of it. Good metabolism, girl. The second thing is, I noticed that I can't talk to her while eating. Talking with your mouth full is a little rude anyway, but with your hands holding chopsticks and a bowl, and bowls, communication between us is impossible, just like yesterday. Even though we're spending the time together, even though I took the time to learn sign language, it feels like I'm talking to her less. Despite that, it feels like I'm understanding her more. Hmm. Weird. Ooh! 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 A challenger appeared! Anyway. A wild lily appeared from the darkness. Ah. I hear the sound of something tapping against one of the stands. And I look up to see Lily standing off to my side. Feeling her way around with her cane. Hi. I near uh, narrowly catch myself be uh, before <laughs> I uh, before I uh, can say didn't see you there. <laughs> oh boy. Just good catch, bro. Good catch. Oh, is that? Oh my god, it's been such a long time since I did Lily. This is the voice. <laughs> uh. Oh. Uh, oh, is that? It's. Is that you? I thought that I smelled something delicious cooking. And I wondered who it might be. <clears throat> oh my god. My throat. Hold on, need water. Well. <clears throat> oh, right. Language barrier. Uh. <laughs> What's she saying? Oh, God, I'm going to get those voices mixed up so hard. 
It's hard to move my hands in parallel to saying something completely different to Lily. This has to be why Misha just signs everything at this time it, a bit sillier. But it seems <clears throat> it seems like it would simplify a, a things a lot. Susan A tense her fingers delight, uh, delighted at my uh, translation as if from hearing a joke. Oh, this, all oh, this food has, uh, was cooked hours ago, but for someone as slow as yourself, who can't even turn in a piece of paper without being late, a week late, I guess your, uh, per uh, perception of time would have to be a little bit different. Ooh, that's not very nice. A frown across the- You didn't tell her that you were with Suzune, did you? You just made things a little bit awkward. A frown crosses Lily's face in response to the reply to something she didn't hear. Uh, sorry. I'm just having a late lunch here with the student council president. <laughs> student council president cooked everything. <clears throat> the student council president is here right now. She's right here. Right now. <laughs> I apologize, I didn't notice. Normally, uh, her level of presence is much higher. I was just not aware the student council president serves lunches outdoors. Why wasn't I invited? I think that it is a good to have, much, have enough free time to be able to do things like this, however. What she's, <clears throat> what she's saying? What's with this ellipses, bro? Oh, you're resigning. If, if she were to invite you anywhere, you would uh, just show up late. But Suzanne's words are outside of Lily's perception. In fact, that it may be the second incredibly maddening to her. Translate for me completely, please. <sighs> she knows. What a polite phrasing. It's a shame she's <laughs> essentially asking me to let her fully release the dog. Uh, excuse me. Let me, uh, let me say this correctly. Let slip the dogs of war. Uh, Caesar reference. We uh, caught it, nailed it, mm, done. Let's play, done. Okay, no. no. <laughs> Let's keep on going. Still, I can't just do nothing. The feeling of being unable to uh, even respond and be understood is so isolating. She would never forgive me. I'll just try to soften her words a little. Yeah, just, just cushion it. Just cushion it. So you don't seem like a dull ass. Well, actually, this what I was all cooked a while ago. Really? That's nice. <laughs> Turn over. <laughs> oh, she noticed it. Turn, turn over here. It's very disrespectful not to look at a person you're not uh, you're speaking to. It, that isn't the way a prim and proper lady would should conduct herself. Bitch. <laughs> Just felt like a bitch would proper right there. Uh, gotta love it. Uh, wait. Half of what I'm saying is really what this, um, what Sune is saying. Uh, she doesn't like it, uh, when people don't look at her in the, her direction when she's trying to make a point. She's, a uh, to your right of my voice. Although, I have to, I, although in this case, I can understand why Lily wouldn't 
it was very awkward. It's a very awkward situation. It's daunting being so at the sole conduit of dialogue. We're <laughs> dialogue between the two of them. Is there gonna be another fight? Another like fight scene? Because uh, yeah. It can't fight! Truthfully, I had forgotten what happened last time when they butted heads. Hey, I just brought it up! Like this. It's clear Suzanne remembers. And Lily is being pretty hostile herself. Dude, just females never forget. Just never, ever forget. That's what I learned in life. Nothing. Nothing's forgotten. <laughs> Uh, in her own way. I'm sorry, such a form, uh, such formalities slipped my mind completely. I forgot the student council president is the type of person who would demand such a respect of adherent uh, and adherence to the rules at all times. Ooh. I suppose the student council, uh, student government requires you to keep a tight ship. Then again, she certainly has time for her own fun as well. So, that must uh, not be completely true. Student council is a, not a dictatorship, nor a zero-sum game. Bam! <laughs> Suzume points at Lily with her finger out like a barrel of a gun and snaps her fingers explosively, uh, causing her to flinch and be uh, become visibly upset. Is that so? Then the <laughs> then that makes it more imp impressive that you have uh, been a part of it for so long, playing it as though it were one. I admire the fact that you are so t uh, tenacious, so uh, to manage it all, you must be so responsible as well. Damn. Damn. Some polite shots are being fired here, guys. From Lily. L Lily is shooting some polite fire. Not as much as I would like to be. You can't complain about it yourself, though, can you? You're very, very responsible. Actions like requesting a deadline to be extended, and then running all over, all the way through the to the next deadline. That's ve that's a ve the very model of responsibility. My tongue is slipping like a mother. Yeah. <clears throat> Suzume is very happy to hear that, <laughs> but apparently you're very responsible. You're pretty responsible yourself, she says. Just sweeten up this pot. Just sweeten up the pot here. Just try and avoid. Just try and avoid any form of cat fight. Does she really? Ah, look at you! Look at you being sarcastic! More or less. Lily doesn't seem very happy. You're not holding a cookout. We're just ha taking a little lunch break. We're actually out of- uh, out here building stalls for the festival. Wouldn't you, uh, wouldn't know since you never go outside. Did you, n uh, run out of tea? Oh, she knows about the tea room. Does she know about the tea room? Does she? The, the room I met Lily in? Does she? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> anyway. Are you going into town shopping? <laughs> I like that face. No, as I said before, I just, I was just passing by. In case you did not hear, I would hate to interrupt the student council president. You're not uh, doing anything now, 
but you uh, must. <laughs>